the process is is actually has been a, a little bit of a long process. Um, understand what the different technologies for atomization, and there's water atomization, there is um, gas atomization. We utilize gas atomization, and there's a special atomizers that we're working with, and it has a very special nozzle, and that nozzle can create very, very high forces. We're utilizing argon gas and an extreme high pressure, and this pressure so far, our first run, we're able to create very, very spherical material and also very, very fine. And we're able to control that, that fineness through the velocity of the, the uh, gases. So far, from our initial runs, we're able to control the particle size through the atomization process. We didn't have to utilize um, any post-process of, of sieving or, or air classifications. That's what we've been using. It's a huge cost savings. I won't be able to tell you that because it's, it's probably one of our, our formulas that we won't disclose yet. Yeah, because okay. that's our secret, like kind of like we know what that works really well. Okay. Everybody, everyone's going after that. So we feel very confident we can actually do that because we've done it already. And it's a matter of scaling and it's a matter of finding our right partners to work with. And we will be starting to look for partners to, to do this. You can expect to see a, a, a final 3D part finish probably within three to four months. 